Hello everyone, my name is Nakak and welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another commentary video and in this essentially commentary video I'm actually going to be talking about something which I have realized that something has been happening on YouTube uh, like happening a lot on YouTube, on YouTube. I'm sorry if I just stutter a bit more like that because it's just like this is the topic which I don't really like, not so much I don't like to talk about, I mean I do like to watch other people talk about but it's not so much I don't know how to talk about it because I'm, I'm, as I said, I'm not really used to like over King and going to talk about all those kind of stuff. I'm, just, I'm much more enough to stick to the games and you know, whether something new update comes out, but it's something which I has been actually getting my nerves quite recently. I mean, the things I'm going to talk about later on. And the entire scam thing, so let me just explain what's been happening with that, and then I, I don't know, let's. You don't have to die budget the intro because I already did that, but essentially what's been happening is. But well, well, very recently, I mean, I don't think it's really say recently, just like for quite some sample, very recently I have seen like. A huge amount of essentially these kind of like scam comments. And actually, let me just pull them up from essentially what those should we just say something, something like, Oh, message me on Telegram to earn the prize. Basically, all those kinds of comments, but essentially, they would actually never drop your link. They would just have to tell you, like, in the name actually, how to actually you can contact them for the for the surprise. Which, first of all, I just want to say, actually, just for a bit, a bit a big up from YouTube, that like they're able actually to somehow you know, stop the uh, scam links. I, I mean, maybe because I say because I haven't seen them in a while, but that's, that's the only kind of ways actually of scamming which I have that I've seen, so it's... Uh, yeah, YouTube, uh, multi-billion dollar company probably, that actually would have been able to do it much earlier, but... Uh, hey, plus is still a plus, so... But I've been seeing from people like Jack Mr. Shinks, which I do actually watch it from time to time. I talk actually do watch it a long time, but I mean, it hasn't happened watching it, but actually when I did see that, I had to take a screenshot with Jim. Which probably you guys have probably seen this screenshot of why I'm talking about this. And so Fortnite channel official themselves and that's the one actually which actually hasn't hurt me the most since they know the Fortnite official channel actually does actually have those spam bots, which I mean it wouldn't be a surprise but the fact that Fortnite essentially it might make you some people feel really like I mean like children because obviously some people that play these games actually as children like essentially for them just to be like essentially, you know, Send a comment, then it's actually some scammers are trying pretending to be Fortnite trying to message them, and it's kind of not so much harder to debunk, but it's just kind of like it's much easier for them to say, Oh, hey, we as an entire company would like to give you this giveaway. Well, that was just one person like I talk, and that's that's still something that's been actually as I've been happening. I've seen all of these comments saying that actually very recently when I was watching, I believe one of the loser who's video when he was she was. I think it was worth seeing looking for his skin not going it wasn't really much of a was but then I just this is what I've seen. Like a few straight up comments like being like uh, that just to scam people. I mean I don't know if it was actually just kind of actually people just you know wondering like the engine because I mean there's actually nothing it's just like oh come and hit me and you know when there's giveaway I mean there's like in the in the title title of the name of the channel's but it's not really like really anything in the comments, it's just like talk about the video, so I kind of feel like maybe these people change the name to the books and just get more attention, like you know, to get more publicity, but I still haven't actually clicked on the channel because you know it, I I don't want to try to get a virus on my phone, to be fair. But actually that's not the first as a, that's not the first time I've seen that essentially these kind of comments are coming up and actually I watched one video from DJ Cook actually he did made a video about it to get a refresh myself on the topic is actually what's been happening with that. And um I mean, I do actually enjoy DJ Cook's content, but this one we can make this video is just be more like kind of the things like, oh yeah, these scammers, well, they're not going to do much to you if you don't give them uh, information. But it's just be more like, oh, I mean, he wasn't trying to tell you like, not to advise to save them. Let's check the ending part, which I was just like, he was just saying like, oh, these these scammers, if you do go message them, just you know, make fun of them, while not realizing that you know these scammers could actually take your like information just because the two scams he, he spoken with you know didn't do much as far I mean as far as I know because he hasn't updated on anything about that I don't think but it's this thing like I mean I don't want to say like you know it's like oh yeah just saying like, go message them but I think you should, at the end you should have said like oh don't message these scams these clearly scams but I don't know call me Jim the Boomer but I think he has actually made a difference I'll try to that essential video. And now moving on to the topic which I mainly wanted to make this video about just kind of like, you know, things like V-Box and Fortnite like essentially scans all kind of like not so much V-Box as more like but just you know those spam bots or something else, but the actual topic of the which I want to talk about is actually like you know these cameras actually not spam but 
essentially these sponsors trains that could get hacks for the certain games and now using actual content creators thumbnails for these scams and recently you know while well, I was like watching some Genshin content of by some people I mean I don't really watch Genshin content that much because well I I don't understand that Genshin content is bad but it's just like you know there's compared actually to someone like essentially like a uh, Wolfie plays actually whenever he plays just like they don't really like make videos about the game just be more like you know they play the game they rage about the game and just kind of like you know that kind of goes within and the Genshin content is it doesn't really have anything like that, where it's just like, you know, some kind of trolling thing, or, you know, anything that I do find interesting. I mean, there's some good content that I still still watch, but just, you know, this is why I don't really watch it that much, so which is why I only recently just realized that this is actually hacking websites that can get you unlimited primo gems. Which is why I actually haven't got to my radar, and to be fair, the first thing I've seen this, I thought that was actually just the actual video just being said at the end, I was just like, oh, actually this video is being put as an ad? I mean, it's cool. It actually does tell you how to get pretty much up pretty quick. So yeah, I thought that was pretty decent. But then actually I realized that time I tried to watch a bit of that video and I was just like, dude, this is completely scam slash using stealing just almost thumbnails for it's it's just it's just wrong in every single direction. And actually, this is part of which I'm gonna kind of like say like you know, YouTube, what the fuck is this? Like, why does this actually ask get to keep running around? stealing someone else's thumbnail, trying to say you know there's something else, and you just don't do anything about it. But it, it actually does piss me off, because I, I've, I've said this multiple times on my channel. Like, there was a situation with the fun which I had, essentially, I was actually, you know, I was playing my hero on Justice 2, which I mean, I do still play the game, but essentially, I was made a video, essentially, like, you know, when I was playing as Uchaka Uraka, and I had this, like, specific, like, uh, thumbnail, which, basically, has nothing to do with sexual, there was nothing sexual about it, just, like, you know, the part where, you know, whenever you do win, they would like do specific powers after the win, but essentially, uh, th that from they got removed because apparently it was sexual, uh, sexual something, some bullshit, and that video wasn't even up. That on private, that was like preparing the video to go up, like say the specific date, and somehow YouTube hit that, and <laughs> even though it wasn't even out, no one was able to actually report anything. So I mean, I'm I'm still kind of like mad about it because how come I? Who's a small creator? I'm I'm, I'm six hundred sorry, which I'm actually do really crap, but to be fair, to be fair, to compare to like other people, I'm I'm pretty much nobody in, on this content. If I compare myself to other people. But somehow YouTube was able to do that. But yet there's like these people who first of all make ads, like they promote some other website you know, the, which would probably scan which is uncle the scan because you know the website that you can get free premium jobs, they're probably gonna steal your information. Using someone else's thumbnail and YouTube does nothing about it. I, the actual, actual uh, person actually on the phone that actually made this video, just got even said on essentially on the post on the Discord messages. Um, I, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to have that because I'm, I'm not sure if I'm just out to like screenshot from their Discord. But they even say uh, they link to this actually link to their Twitter to actually to get YouTube attention about it, and YouTube has to have the response to that. So it's just like, um, how come YouTube doesn't see that that these, these just fucking ad scamming videos are still running around using someone else's thumbnail, and they're probably actually, they're probably people thinking that's actually, you know, that's actually, that Jazz Girl actually, the person who originally made that thumbnail on such a video, that's probably thinking that, you know, that's her worry because I originally thought it was because from the thumbnail, to be fair, I originally thought it was because I actually went in and watched it. And so for the average people, actually, they wouldn't actually know whether, you know, that's theirs or not. So it's just, that's kind of blows my mind that YouTube doesn't really take stuff seriously. Because I said, I've checked Twitter and they haven't responded back to it. Essentially, I figured that's an issue I have to do is you need to have like enough likes on that post for them to YouTube to do that. Because I remember when they were Chino, Chino Holo got this YouTube banned and he was just posting on Twitter essentially YouTube because something. He would actually kind of get my attraction on that specific Twitter post for YouTube to do anything. And that kind of really sucks because I've watched actually a few of Jazz Girls videos and to be fair they're actually pretty pretty good they're very pretty decent actually made like they actually have a lot put into them and essentially she just like getting like just steamrolled by all these scams just that's just not very good that's just not a very good image to be fair and I'm um, I'm making this video so just kind of like bring attention I'm, I'm sorry if I was kind of like wobble your around but to be fair I'm just thinking about it. I'm just 
just somewhat pissed off that YouTube actually does shit like that. I'm sorry if I'm sorry because all, all the time, that's all the time, but I've said a few times, but just like I'm just really, really annoyed with this. Like, yeah, guys, I have no idea. And to finish off this video, I'm actually gonna have like a down below under this video, which I'm not sure how many people could watch it because it's the end of the video, but essentially down below there's gonna be a link to the Jazz Gallus Twitter with the specific powers. And if you could please, if you could please just like it or you know, leave a comment or something, it's just for YouTube to actually see it. Because it's, this is something which that should just only happen in YouTube. We, I should be I should be making this video talking about this because YouTube should be able to do this, but it does happen, so we, we gotta do something about it. Yet again, apologies for this even because I have a scout mate, but whenever I do think about this, whenever I do think about the situation, I try to talk about it, I'm just I'm just pissed. So I'm I'm gonna try to essentially make it so it's not a scout, but I'm sorry if it does. But anyway, that's gonna be it for this. Video. As I said, please go out, please support the actual creator from that for actually being taken advantage of and. Please actually go on to the Twitter and actually do something so YouTube does easy. But anyway, I'm gonna be heading out now, guys, and I hope to see you guys in the next time. Peace.